I'm going hard, I guess. Can you stop? No, no you're not I'm smoking. Not. No, stop. In today's video, I'm going to be reacting to a Code Blue Cam video titled What Happens When You Shove Drugs in a Cop's Face? Let's jump right into it. 23. Police directed extra attention towards a parking ramp in La Crosse, Wisconsin. As officers were monitoring the parking ramp cameras, they observed several people obstructing the passageway with a significant amount of belongings in the stairwells. Among them, one individual was identified as Ashley, a 34-year-old female with whom officers had previous encounters with. At least they laid down newspaper. Who's the, how many f CSCs we got in here? Three. Holy sh! I see there's just yeah, another one f ripping in there. While they made contact with individuals on the first couple floors of the ramp, Ashley was heard screaming and yelling from the floor above. Was it this stairwell that we got? Yeah, another up the elevators. What's going on today? I'm not sure. How's it going? Not too much. What, what the hell is this thing? I'm just trying to build a little car to move my stuff around. I'll get, I'll get everything packed. I got gotcha. you. Do you got an idea on your partner? Yeah. Thank you, brother. She then came running down the fifth floor, but quickly ran back up when she immediately recognized the officers. No. So remember, the police can temporarily detain you so long as they have reasonable suspicion. What is reasonable suspicion? Reasonable suspicion is some objective fact. It's more than just a hunch that a crime is being committed or just recently has been committed. Here, uh, they were monitoring a building, which they're allowed to do. They're allowed to lawfully observe any building. And they noticed some suspicious activity. It could be a whole number of things. Remember, reasonable suspicion is a very very low bar so the police can investigate they can request identification they can actually do that even if they don't have reasonable suspicion it just means that you can voluntarily not cooperate here i don't know if the police have reasonable suspicion or not but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and assume i think they probably do but regardless uh, these individuals are cooperating with the investigation regardless so the reason that we're out here with you is because of this stuff okay it's Sorry. blocking egress i'm gonna it's, move out because we got cameras and stuff and we got people watching and we can't you know that's why we're out here i'll get it moved out right now thank you no problem do you guys have a 24-hour notice thing have you guys been given one of these before no okay oh yeah i've gotten one of those before yeah we'll give you another one again yeah. 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 Who's yelling up here? I don't know. It's a girl with a purple hair. I thought there was no heat running in this building. It's hot as shit in here. It's because there's people in here. There's just human shit in here. Uh, Hello? What's up, dudes? What's up? What's up? How's it going? Pretty good. How's it going? Good, man. Holy no. shit, man. No. No? I was just cleaning up the place. So I think this place did. I'm waiting on Frankie to come back up here. So they can't be in here. Oh, he can't be in here? Oh, okay. I'm Wait, it's been like that for yeah, forever. Yeah, what about Frankie, though? He's got no place to go, bro. Yeah. Unfortunately, we're we don't. Supposed to, we're supposed to have set up bed for him sitting on You know what I'm saying? You can't do it here. All right, I'll move it all out of y'all within 20 minutes. All right, down in the park, I guess. <coughs> hey, man, you can't smoke in here, brother. The guy just smoking right in front of the police officer this building's kind of a disaster the cops seem pretty cool though they're not you know they just want everybody out is what it seems like you got an idea on your partner who me yeah. no why are you running my name because you can't put in here i shouldn't have a warrant i gotta see my po tomorrow Rob, real quick please stand up for me okay just for me okay why what's that why because we're gonna search you real quick for what what's that do you want to turn around for us this yep. one why am i going to jail i'm going to what jail Oh, buddy. You, want to jail. Uh, you don't think anyone's gonna poker stick me? No. Okay. You just put your hand yeah, on the dope on it. Just be straight. No, I shouldn't. What do you, that means you gotta do? Where's the dope at then? Cause I don't. Okay. Well, the average person says no to that question. Not. Okay. So they are going inside of his pocket, right? Which means they are conducting something called a sit lay, search incident to a lawful arrest. That's more than just a Terry Frisk where they would pat down the outside of your clothes. They are going to search him. That means they have probable cause for something. What do they have probable cause for? Well, the most immediate thing they have probable cause for is trespassing. They are very clearly trespassing on this property. So yeah, it's probably within the police's rights to search, right? And they're probably looking for paraphernalia. As they spoke with the male individuals, they could now hear Ashley yelling from what seemed to be inside the elevator. Only thing I have is that CBD dad bait. Okay. 
Well, Ash is really on one today, huh? Yeah. She's the beast. Yeah, I told her I said, you need to stop. What's her deal today? Who is it? I don't know. I mean, Ashley, She's uh, been bone like this since when she disappeared. I don't know. She think a little bit weird sometimes. And then your wallaby guy? No. Nothing on this table? No. It does something? I mean, there shouldn't be. There, there isn't. There isn't. Nothing. No. Okay. I've been getting that. What's in here? Nothing. Just stay over there for me, Robert, okay? Just stay over here by the wall, okay, bro? Appreciate cooperation there. Can I finish getting my stuff ready to go? Yeah, you can start packing that stuff up. Why well, am I going to jail? No one's in jail. Just calm down. As long as you stay cool, you're not going to jail. I'm not trying to pick on you, dude. It oh, seems God. like you guys are signaling me out for some reason. Because that's what my sergeant said on the camera. What? That you were hot piping. No. Is she up there by herself? Yeah, is she in that whole Where the hell is she, guys? Wait. What's up? Yeah, she's, What's up? she's got me now, man. She's oh my god, to Actually, just give us like five more minutes, okay? Just give us, give us a, a second. As long as you get to stay in here, then if you're just sitting with us. She's been trying to steal all Frankie's blankets. I've been waiting on here and watching his stuff for him to come back. Those are horseshoes. I believe you. No, that's all empty. That's from my Dakota's food. Okay. For what we don't finish. Dakota who? Gilbert. Oh, yeah. I've been hanging out with him and helping him fix fights. All right, you're good, buddy. Get yourself. Thank you, Robert. Appreciate your cooperation. Good to see you guys. Appreciate it, Wade. Yeah, no. Upon pressing the elevator button, the doors opened, revealing Ashley inside. You think she's in there? Oh, they all need Oh, Ashley, you need to do that. No! What's going on? Can you settle down for it? She soon pulled out tinfoil, a lighter, and a straw to ingest drugs, a practice commonly known as hop piping. Can you stop? No! no you're not smoking? I'm not, no, stop. I'm stop. Evil. She's got dope in her yeah, so obviously the police officers have probable cause to arrest her at that time. She was smoking or attempting to smoke drug paraphernalia right in front of them. When they tried to handcuff her, Ashley resisted and shoved the drugs in the officer's face. She then ate the tinfoil and its contents without hesitation. Stop. 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 He's going to jail for sure. You need to stop. I need to be a You're going to get charged. I am the worst person on this planet. I know it. I'm so sorry, Mike. I am the worst person in the world. I know it. You're going to jail for sure. Relax. DC attempted battery. You're so hot. Throw a dope in my face is not going to be a good thing. I'm not. You're lucky you didn't get hurt. So by trying to shove the drugs in the police officer's face, that, that's not, that's probably aggravated assault, right? Because that is dangerous. It's more than just a physical punch. You're trying to poison someone, essentially. Ashley, stay in the corner. Okay, sit down. That's cool, too. Dad, get out of my thoughts. Fucking sit. Stop. Oh, I didn't swear kick to God. you. I did not kick you. Stop kicking. Do it. You're going to get hurt. Stop. All right. I didn't say that. Okay, then relax. Don't kick right. us and I won't kick you. All right. Respect and respect. Respect. Okay, deal. Okay. Okay. Don't take his leg off, but don't you kick that. Deal? Deal. I'm fine. She just tried to rub dope in my face. Okay. So I don't know what's in there. So she's on the elevator. Busting out of the I call it up. I don't think in there. Where's she rub that? She's trying to rub it in my face on this side. Adam, see, sir, she's got f***ing dope in her hand and just goes f***ing wipes it, Adam goes to grab it, and she just f***ing knee kicks him, and then tries to f***ing yeah. throw the dope. Hold on, hold on. You ain't powder? Please? I don't know. Open her mouth. She's trying. Dope doesn't come out, so I don't know what he's saying. I didn't see any dope come out. And then she just f***ing eats the entire tin foil. She ate, like, the actual entire tin foil. She's trying to smoke it. I tried to grab her, and she swept around and went, tried to get me in the face. I don't know if she got me or not. I didn't feel it hit me, but it doesn't mean it wasn't powder. No, I don't, you're not feeling it right now. Though. I don't know. I'm a little lightheaded because I'm pissed, but. Let's get her to the hospital. Yeah. We'll meet you down there. Yeah. Because somebody go on that, it's got to be sitting on the floor in that tin foil. I don't know if she got it out or not. I think she ate it, dude. She, she ate the rest of it? She ate the entire tin foil. <clears throat> Since you got those gloves on, check the elevator bay. See yep. if she ate it. I think she ate it right off. I don't think there's anything okay. on it. If it's burnt, I don't give a shit. There's dope on it. Let okay. me know. There, she's got like other stuff in that you want the ID card and everything else out of there too. That's hers. Might as well put it in the okay. bag. So we don't right. have to come back and say it's stolen. Okay. Thank you. All right. I don't know. 
Sorry, just breathe. Yeah. It appeared that Ashley may have just completed pissing in the back corner of the elevator. This subsequently explained why she and the officer's search gloves were wet afterwards. As a result, Ashley was hit with felony counts of second degree recklessly endangering safety, attempted battery to an officer, bail jumping, misdemeanor counts of resisting, obstructing an officer, and disorderly conduct. She so from her perspective, look, she clearly needs help. I don't think she was in her right mind to even enforce her rights. From the police's perspective, they, they clearly did everything correctly. They certainly had probable cause to arrest her. All right, talk to y'all later. Bye. Big verdict.